Jody Lee once said, do your duty in all things. You cannot do more. You should never wish to do less. When I was a cop, I had the reputation of being Dirty Harry. People told me they thought Clint Eastwood movies were based on my life. I did rely on Smith and Wesson 12 or 13 times. The motto of plug em and plan em sure is right for many of society's evildoers. The reason for plug em and plan em I learned in 1960, early in my career as a cop. It's January 1960. This one night, I'm working the graveyard shift. Lights off. Doing the city's back alleyways. Doing the burglar prowl. That's what cops like to do. I'd been a cop for three years. Just a wet-nosed puppy policeman. Apprehending felons is the name of the game for any cop. Catching criminals and doing your thing. runs along the roof toward 7th Street with me chasing him and shouting, freeze, police. Of course, he ignores me. Freeze, police! Pop those hands up, turkey. He's unarmed, but gosh, he's a big guy. As many tattoos say, he's been down the road and around the block a few times. You better get those hands up, boy, or I'm going to use this thing. He is what he looks like. Mean, evil, and wicked. Well, you're going to have to shoot me like you did in Massachusetts, because I'm not going with you. You better think about stopping. For the next one, it's going to be a lead sandwich. Shooting in this situation isn't fair play. A policeman is sworn to overcome resistance. If he would have picked up a weapon, he would have been wearing a toe tag at the morgue. As it was, I couldn't just shoot the guy because he wanted to duke it out with me. The choice was clear cut. It was time to go to Knuckle City. your boxer with a 10 and 0 record i was still looking for my first win films I grew up with, where they are fighting on the edge of a cliff. All I 
can see is the concrete below. I wonder why the hell I didn't shoot this turkey to begin with. I can't reach for my gun now because I run the risk of having the guy grab it and use it on me. My thoughts are my Wonder Woman and our three kids at home. I happened to get lucky and send him off that roof. He happened to get lucky and not be killed by the fall. I snapped handcuffs on him. Then we waited for the backup units. Looking back on it now, down the avenue of second thoughts, I never should have gotten in a fight with that rodent. You can't agree to go 10 rounds with Mike Tyson just because he feels like it. You can't use deadly force against an unarmed man. But then again, cops should not endanger their own lives to save the life of a career criminal. For 29 years, I had the best job this world can offer. No man can ask or want for more. It's life on a roller coaster, expecting the unexpected, and all in the name of service to mankind. The three-letter word cop means champions of people.